I'm Dr. John Ludlow. I'm one of the urologists at uh, Western Michigan Urological Associates. So testosterone and testosterone deficiency is uh, one of the big topics that we see a lot of these days. But low testosterone levels can come with some significant signs and symptoms. It's relatively easy to identify and it's relatively easy to treat. I prefer to see patients in, a, in, in my practice and evaluate them correctly. It's some of these men's health clinics, these strip mall testosterone clinics, the evaluation isn't done correctly, the follow-up isn't done appropriately, and that can lead to other problems. It's really important to have at accurate testing and follow-up. In addition, some of the testosterone boosters and testosterone supplementations that are advertised online or on TV uh, commercials, you have to be careful with those, that they're, that they're appropriate for you. I think some are okay, but it's important to understand that the, uh, the, the, these boosters and these supplements aren't studied adequately. Some have no efficacy. Some need to be stored properly for their efficacy to be maintained. But testosterone boosters and testosterone supplements are really important to talk about from my standpoint and from the patient's standpoint. So going to a practice and a, and a physician that understands testosterone, how to evaluate it, what the signs and symptoms are, how to treat it, and how to follow it is really important. Patients who have sexual dysfunction or obesity or diabetes, or just general complaints of low energy level, low motivation, uh, loss of libido, loss of muscular strength, uh, loss of endurance. Those are, those are the signs and, and the symptoms of low testosterone. And those are the patients that I wanna evaluate correctly. So I see a lot of patients in my practice who come in with sexual dysfunction. Virtually all of those patients I'm gonna to talk to about testosterone, but other patients as well. When I see somebody for benign prostatic disease, who is overweight or who's a diabetic. Those patients really need to be uh, counseled regarding testosterone issues. And the benefits of this can have significant positive effects on their overall health. You know, when, when someone has low testosterone and is on testosterone supplementation, there, there's some obvious endpoints there. Good energy level, good motivation, libido, erections, uh, those types of things, uh, mood elevation, muscular strength. Um, so patients will see significant benefits, but there are potentially other benefits that you don't notice. Your bone health, your muscular health, your cognitive health, your, your sleep health. So there's a lot of benefits that, that maybe are not so obvious, but significantly beneficial.